I'm Rajiv Jan. I'm a practicing gastroenterologist in Dallas, Texas, and I'm the AGA patient education advisor. Many of you may have heard a recent FDA uh, announcement uh, or warning about a procedure called ERCP. I want to take a few minutes and explain what that FDA warning was about. So first of all, ERCP is a procedure performed by typically a gastroenterologist to look at the bile duct or the pancreas tube. And this is a very important therapeutic procedure. What has been announced by the FDA is that there have been some cases of an infection localized to the tip of the scope, which can then be transmitted to patients. And this is an important and serious issue. But the good news is that it is very infrequent. In fact, it, it is probably less than one out of 20,000 procedures. So if you need this life-saving or important diagnostic or therapeutic procedure, you should always talk to your doctor about it before canceling anything. Additionally, I wanna point out that this infection is related to a special scope that we use for the procedure called a duodenoscope. It has a little device at the tip called an elevator, and it's in that little area that the infection has been isolated. That endoscope is very different than the standard forward viewing endoscope we use for routine upper endoscopies or EGDs. Those are scopes performed to look for acid reflux injury, ulcers, or GI bleeding. So again, that's a very different procedure that does not carry the same risk for infection. If your doctor recommends an ERCP, the benefits of the procedure far, far outweigh the risks of the procedure, even knowing this small risk of getting an infection. As always, before you make a decision on canceling a procedure or changing a treatment, you should always confer with your physician to make sure you're doing what's in your best interest. For more information on this or any other health topic, please visit the AGA website at patient.gastro.org.